Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Utopia Origin. Thank you for coming today and hanging out with Yo Boy. So, it's been a long time since the game first came out that I've played Utopia Origin. And I had just done a uh, Let's Play Episode 1 type deal just to, I don't know, we'll say, kind of check the game out a little bit. And I just wanted to share that experience with you guys when I did. Turns out it's one of my most popular videos, and still today, I get people, they keep saying that, hey, you should continue this Let's Play series, I'd like to see some more videos on it, and that's what I'm going to try to do today, so hopefully you guys enjoy this. Now, I do not know a whole lot about this game, we'll go ahead and create the character. The text content is illegal. Mm -hmm. Let's see, can I just do hypertensive? Let's try that. Oh yeah, so I originally logged in, did Hyper 30, and was like, hey, I'll just do it off this one. Well, I decided I want to bring you guys back and just start completely fresh from the beginning, and uh, we'll see what happens. Like I said, I don't know a whole lot about this game. I, I was just figuring it out as I went, and I was sharing what I learned with you guys. Um, so let's just start at this starting ground. I think there are different starting grounds that you can go to. You can zoom out. I did not know that. See, there's starting ground here. Spring Day Coast. Um, let's look around here just a little bit. There's two different starting points. Let's just go with... Let's go with this one down here. It looks like a third one. There's four. Good grief. All kinds of them. Um, yeah, let's go with this one right here. Start Adventure. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Hopefully I can figure out what to do in this game as far as things go. And I would love for your guys' interaction. The reason I'm restarting instead of going from episode 1 of the Let's Play that you'd seen before is after 24 hours, if you don't pick up your things, they immediately, they'll just despawn. So uh, we're going to try to avoid that situation because I don't have anything in it as well. And for anybody new that comes in in the future, uh, hopefully I'll be in line with uh, where we're currently at. So let's check out our little... I don't know, what is it, a fairy? I'm not sure what that you would call, call this little little creature. Okay. Master, do you have any questions? I'll do everything in my power to answer it for you. If you're bored, we can also just have a chat. So, tell me, what can I do right now? Let's just do that. Master, you still don't have a wood axe or wood pick. These two tools are used for collecting wood. Uh, wood and ore. Yeah, it's kind of weird. They haven't fixed the little uh, text issue there, I can see. Uh, respectively. Uh, the majority of tools you can get in the early stages all require wood and stone to make. Please make a wood axe and a wood pick first. Not a problem, boo. So I'm going to get started on that. Same as before. We're going to go ahead and start collecting some resources. I'm going to get fiber. I'm going to get wood and stone. And I'll bring you guys back in just a minute. <laughs> Way back, so I was all over the place there, as you could probably tell. I was there's a lot of resources to gather, especially when you first start out. A lot of wood, a lot of fiber. I got a lot of stone and such. So we're going to start off by uh, making some of our basic things. I'm already in the water. Hmm. I don't see the water line. I was a little bit confused. So um, I always like to build, especially just starting out um, near the water, just so I, I have that accessible to me. We might 
build a little camp next to these metal nodes to start us out. I think there's a nice little spot over here if nobody has it. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so apparently you have to get like uh, build a hearth, like a hearthstone, and then that's how you can get your home. Uh oh, we're getting attacked. Uh, so let's knock this little dude out. You get five wood from these, what are they called, treants, I believe. You get five wood per each one that you kill. So that's pretty nice. I'm already up to level seven, so I've been grinding. I know level ten we can get some uh, some very useful tools and such. Is somebody set up right here? What is that? Yeah, somebody's got anvil and such. Watch out, bruh. Um, so I don't want to crowd them people, so we'll just go right down here next to this other little node. I thought this little area right here behind me uh, was a nice little spot. But that's okay. We can still come up here and harvest because it doesn't look like anybody's online. I just don't like to crowd people. And there's a spot there, so we'll just go right on the beach. So let's see what we can make. It looks like we can make our fire, so we'll go ahead and hit our little play button there, and it'll go ahead and craft up our fire. I have some meat. I was trying to get some hide is pretty much why I was um, killing all those pigs and such. There we go. Let's just place this down right here. It's just perfect. Fantastic. So let's go ahead and start cooking up some of this food. Make. And it looks like we can make a drumstick. And we can make five pork chops. Let's just make the batch. What do we got here? Hmm. Can I, can I click over here? No. That's just, this is fine. Um, you can barbecue apples and such. So that's pretty cool. Uh, we got plenty of food for the moment. So let's see. What else can we do here? Not in this green. That's for show. Sure. Not in this green. But we still have just our regular clothes and armor um, that we spawned in with. Let's see. Is it not the backpack? For some reason, I thought it was the backpack. Oh, right here. Okay. So, facility. Let's make a workbench. We'll make one. What's up with this music right now? It sounds a little scary. I'm getting a little frightened. I think because it's nighttime. We should have imps around. Like, yeah, there's an imp. So, you definitely want to kill these imps. If you've never played this before and you want to start, it's a really fun game. Um, these imps will drop orbs, and they're going to be very useful and beneficial to you, especially as you craft more armor and tools and weapons and stuff like that. You need these orbs. So, definitely, they spawn, it said, between uh, midnight and 6 a.m. So, definitely get on that every night. Go out hunting these imps. Can you follow me? Hmm... Yeah, you're following me. Um, and I'll show you what I mean by these orbs. Right here. There's little green glowing orbs. Pick up that. And you'll want to save up as many as you can. So let's go ahead and place down our little crafting bench here. Uh-oh. Not there, you big goof. We're just going to put it right beside of our fireplace. There we go. So no, or on top. Whichever. Whichever's fine. Um, <laughs> what am I in? Am I in the bench? looks like it so now we can start looking into armor we can start looking into these different um, areas here let's see I think I done messed up let me see if I can fix this I'll be right back okay so I figured it out if you go up to the whatever you're wanting if it be the fire if it be our little crafting bench you hit your little hand and you can hit adjust position I don't know why I never thought of that but uh, you just move your character around and then we can move it just like a so much better <laughs> alright so now what does it say make what can we make so nothing is unlocked at this moment so if you see we have wooden lockers um, so we need to make several of the the little lockers and such um, furnace smelting furnace you have to be level 10 to create that same thing with uh, silkworm rack kindlin uh, per personal refining furnace just anything in the, the uh, smelting facility section there. Same thing with the manufacturing. Uh, you have to be a certain level before you can make those. So, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to cut two. I'm not going to bore you guys with the uh, resource resource gathering. I'm probably going to go ahead and start getting into some metal and such. Repairing my tools up. And once we reach level 10, I'll make these and bring you guys right back. Alright ladies and gentlemen, we're back. I've been doing the grinding thing. I got a bunch of stuff. I need to go ahead and cook some things up here. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and make some very useful um, items for us. Let's see, what do I have? Oh, a ton of steak. Fantastic. So let's let that make up. Can I just let that do its thing? No, you have to stay in there while it does it. That's fine. So let's hop into our workbench here. Um, definitely want the smelting facility. 
and it seems to be all we can get at the moment uh, but it's going to be very useful for us so let's go ahead and throw this thing down um, not shortcut bar well, I guess it's going to go here <laughs> okay uh, out of there fantastic and we'll just throw this right behind our fire should be fine great now hopefully I have plenty of coal I should let's go ahead and smelt up we have 24 iron ingots and let's see surely I got coal surely we don't want leaf um, there we go so we don't need all 13 that's for sure let's just go ahead and just put like three pieces of coal in there and let that start cooking uh, after submitting materials time will increase okay that's that's fine so let's let that burn baby is it cooking I'm kinda confused what happened there's no animation burn time left yeah it's working fantastic alright so one more thing I wanna do before the end of the episode um, I'll definitely kill some imps but I wanna try to get a horse now in the last episode or the 1.5 of the let's play that I kinda started which the 1.5 was way after it as well um, I kinda went over how to tame a brown horse but I'm gonna do that again today um, so first things we need to do is go ahead and create our saddle so we're gonna go up to the hand up in the top left corner click items and go down to companions and mount it needs 10 pieces of wood and one piece of leather now I went around and got a bunch of hide and made a piece of leather up for us so let's go ahead and make that saddle up once we do we'll throw it down into our hot bar so it's just about done fantastic let's go into our backpack here oh it's already down there great so now let's run around these horses see if we can't find some carrots so I don't see any right in the general area. Let's go and get this wheat because I want to get. Hey, there's a carrot. I want to get uh cows. I seen when I was killing cows. Um, that they need wheat to tame. Now I don't know. Maybe you need a collar or something, um, to go around their necks so that they can be your friend. And you may not be able to really keep them. I'm not sure until you get a house. And that's something I'm definitely going to try to do in the very near future because I've never done before. These guys just want to go, huh? All right. Let me take these guys out really quick. What? Well, we're back. I accidentally hit the horse, so let's go ahead and tame this thing up. <laughs> so what you want to do is use your club, and you want to keep hitting that horse till it's dazed. Uh oh, I don't have any. Uh, uh oh, I don't have any carrots in our hot bar shortcut bar. We're gonna put it right here. I only have three, so hopefully that's enough. Uh oh, fix our. This is just catastrophe. This is catastrophe. So I fixed our little. Uh, uh, man, turn around here. Hmm. This is not going well. <laughs> there we go. So I fixed our club. Lady? No. This is my horsey. Back up. Okay. So I fixed our club. You want to hit the horse until it is stunned. You'll see here in just a second as they're... Okay, it's stunned. So let's go ahead and feed a carrot. Feed a carrot. I have three carrots. It wasn't enough. Oh, no. Hmm. Epic fail. Okay, let's try this again. So I got seven carrots now. That should be enough. There's a couple right here if I need them. And I'll grab really quick. If I can get this horse, but he's up on this bank. This is this is how you know it's real, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> uh, the struggle. The struggle's real. Um, so yeah, it's not too bad. I mean, uh, usually it's not this difficult. I don't know what the issue is where they're kind of... Okay, so it's stunned. So let me feed the carrot. Keep feeding it. Keep feeding it. Keep feeding it. Okay, now hit the saddle that's in your inventory and boom um, so it took what four carrots and then it said um, that it was ready to be tamed to use your taming item well we had our taming item which was the saddle and it was in our little hot bar I had just tapped that and now if you look right abo above our jump button right here on the right uh, there is the little horseshoe if you hit that boom ladies and gentlemen we got ourselves a horse <laughs> <laughs> Let me get these carrots real quick, actually. And when you want to put your horse away, you just tap that uh, that little uh, horseshoe again. So yeah, that's that's pretty cool, if you ask me. Uh, let's see if we can get back to the base here and uh, maybe see how much metal we got going. Now the significance of getting a, a mount, uh, especially a rideable mount, you're faster for one. Um, but they're very useful. I mean, you can still attack you can still gather resources from on the horse's back so that's pretty cool I think as well pretty cool feature um, the horse does not jump uh, I know there are different kinds of horses from my extent of playing um, I've seen blue horses and such but they take different items to tame and that's something I have to figure out uh, hopefully you guys 
enjoyed this video. I know I stumbled through it. Like I said, I don't know a whole lot about the game. Uh, hopefully we can learn together as, as time travels on here. Um, I picked up a bunch of pumpkins and it said it was dangerous to eat raw. But I don't see. I guess we would need a cooking pot and stuff. So I definitely have a lot to lear learn. I'm going to try to do some research on the game. Let's get a drink of water. And hopefully uh, in the next episode we have some pretty cool stuff for you guys. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Leave in the comment section that you enjoyed it. And that you want to see this Let's Play continue. Alright guys. Thank you for coming and hanging out today with your boy. If you haven't already, go and subscribe to the channel. Hit that little bell icon so every time I upload, you can come hang out. We'll see you next time. See ya. Bye-bye.